professor. Jones, it is really good to see you. How are you? That's so great to hear. And it is a pleasure for me to be fitting you out with all of your tailor-made attire this evening. Thank you so much for getting in contact with me and enabling me to travel all the way here to see you to make sure we can get all of your, shall we say, work attire fitted and feeling great for you but most importantly looking great there as well so we had a very specific list of items that you want made from trousers to shoes to numerous belts and then finally a perfect fedora hat for you there as well we have everything here that has been made by hand according to your needs and all the things that you sent to us to be, shall we say, smartened up just a little bit. Uh, well, you're going to be very pleasantly surprised what we were able to do here for you as well. So, if you would allow me, I'm just going to place the box with all of your items over there. We will get you, well, get you ready and then get you fitted with all of your personal clothing as it were so does that sound all perfectly acceptable for you we feel incredibly honored to have a professor of such high esteem such as yourself dr jones to be of course shopping with us and over in the other side of the seas there as well uh, we feel a great honor that should you wish to visit our humble tailor store to get all of your things that you need and to make sure that everything is going to be perfectly fitted for you and all of the adventures now i know that you said uh, discretion is of course important for your adventures and what you told us remains personally with me i've made sure that in the store that everything is custom made for certain things uh, that you might be carrying along the way and don't worry i was able to arrange everything for you dr jones to make sure that your travels and adventures abroad will of course be not interrupted by uh, anything to do with well in a clothing sense anyway so you can rest assured that whatever you're doing all of our custom made clothes here for you will last throughout anything whatever sort of shall we say fight you might find yourself in whether it be sophisticus or perhaps it might be weapons such as uh, pistols or something like that or should you wish to use your whip or something it has all been perfectly uh, arranged and designed to have ease of use so you will always be protected and make sure that you don't find yourself a little bit of a pickle when you are on your adventure so can I place this on the table over there and we can get you fitted into your attire? I know time is also the essence of you as you will be traveling soon. Indeed. Thank you. So, just want to check and make sure that. Uh, we've got everything here which you ordered okay so one of the things here so we have our shirt okay this is a khaki of course and this particular shirt has got lapels on the top so why don't we get you fitted in that first excellent um uh, thank you uh dr jones but i don't drink when i'm on that work call uh, perhaps afterwards so one of the items we have here this is your shirt, Dr. Jones, and specifically uh, how you asked for it as well. So we have uh, our lapels at the top there on your shoulders. Okay, and they have been buttoned up. You'll notice as well that we use thick cotton material 
around the buttons there too to make sure that whatever you're doing none of these things are going to fall off everything's hard wearing but also very comfortable there as well so they will fit very nicely on you the collar of course is made of the finest materials and cottons and this is going to feel exceptionally airy for when you're abroad and also very comfortable when you're wanting maneuverability there as well. If we move down your desired pockets on your shirt, similar to previous ones you've had, is that correct? Excellent. Okay, let me show you here. So we have our pocket here on your chest and this is a very durable pocket specifically designed for you to place specific items in there that you might find along the way there as well so we will just open that up there for you and you'll notice that there's plenty of space in there for you to you know do what you need to do let me do that of you should you find things along the way you know that uh, a pocket like this which is really durable and has a very high tensile strength there as well nothing's going to fall out or uh, get lost in there so you know that you can put shall we say precious artifacts in there something like that whatever you'd like to get dr jones you know whatever you search for of course you've told me all about your archaeological adventures exciting to say the least i wish i could be on there with you as well far too dangerous for me probably okay and on the other side we have the same sort of pocket okay it's the button on there and you see the cotton around the button there is thick durable cotton so you know that it's not gonna come off in a hurry there as well the stitch work around the buttonholes there okay we have very nice stitch work around there so this is nice and thick and it's not going to get ruined at all so we just do that up there special care and attention has been placed into all of your items dr jones and this particular one is without any exception to the quality that we'd like to provide here for you so i think this according to all of the measurements that we took for you this is going to be a perfect fit for you so how about we just put this one on okay and let me see uh, how it is in your case so if you'd like to just put your arm through there okay excellent and then oh, back there run the back just do up your cuffs there as well so one of the things let me just take that off there for you so one of the things that you will notice there is i've put two buttons on there depending on what sort of environment you're at if it's too hot then you can open it up it will flow very nicely on your arm like so if it's a little bit cooler you can do it on the, the inner button there Okay, so you've got more space around, but something a little bit more formal. Dr. Jones, then you can put it in a little bit further up, so it's a nice uh, tight fit. Perhaps it's a little bit uh, warmer there for you as well. Okay, so what would your preference be now? We'll just put it on the sort of warm area on the inner one. Excellent. Same again on the other arm there for you. It's the same care and attention and all the little details I've personally uh, applied in all of your clothing uh, Dr. Jones to make sure that whatever your adventure you're, you're on your clothing will not let you down at all so I'll do that last not the same just check it and make sure there's lots of airiness in there and I hope you don't mind if I can have just the slightest measure there just to make sure that Dr. Jones if you could just put your arm out there for me okay just make sure that's the correct length on your arm it is perfect and same again your right arm please and that's
that's exactly the same there as well. It's a perfect fit. Let me just check the distance of your collar there and your shirt. A perfect fit. Excellent. And I'm just going to pull the shirt down here. And pull it down as far as it would go. Make sure that's the correct distance there. Excellent. Now, we're not going for anything smart, of course, we're going for functionality, but you know, Dodge Jones, that everything that I create, I try to make sure it's made at the very highest of standards, and these measurements might mean nothing to other people, but for uh, someone like me, I just like to make sure that everything's perfect. Okay, next up, we have a pair of trousers, or oh, you might call them pants, of course. check the book here what we desire ah okay so we wanted khaki uh, brown pants here trousers okay needed to be airy and breathable functional without pockets and around the back there as well we wanted a button at the front there, of course, standard practice for lots of trousers there, and they needed to be four down, an inch from the down by your feet there, as far as that, was that, and then also you wanted a belt that was going to be in military, um, military khaki colour there with a buckle at the front, yeah, and yeah, right, okay, and that, that was it. Here we have your custom made trousers here. So these are really uh, smart. The thing is, a lot of people won't understand the subtlety that uh, it has taken to create something like this. Something more casual where it will not be as fully appreciated. But if you just allow me to explain certain things here for you, like the back pocket button here. Okay, it's quite discreet and there's plenty of room to place certain items in there should you need to as well. This has been made from a really nice fabric which I found and this is quite rare and I think a fabric like this suits you even better for your archaeological adventures. It's uh, just a slight nod there for you as well. Okay, and the same in the back there, open that up and uh, space for all your things there too. Now I know that you've we're following the exact style which you've uh, worn previously, but with just some subtle nods and differences, and like I might I say, some slight improvements here and there. Okay, so we have uh, stitching around here uh, for your belt there as well. And one of the things I've added here as well is some rubber on the inside here. Okay, and this is just going to help keep your trousers into position because you said or expressed of all of your strenuous activities and you wouldn't want your clothes to fail you so this is going to make sure it stays up on your waist and you'll be able to see it just there i mean you can hear it okay at the front standard practice there okay clip on for your trousers and then our buttons down there i've added uh, two buttons on there and those are the same that follow the same formula as uh, your shirt so it's all in quite hard wearing cottons there so we have two inner pockets there and deep inner pockets there too so you might see from here how deep these pockets are and the same again on the other side there too okay so these are nice and deep and plenty of room for all of your activities okay and just before we put them on we have a belt here to go with it so we have the gold buckle and this is you had something similar previously um, but you opted for gold this time so there's your buckle and then our military khaki colored uh, belt there with 
the gold top on the end and simply to work insert in it goes pull it to desired length pull cross type it's not going anywhere dr chin so they should be more than efficient and sufficient for your trousers so perhaps you would allow me just to place these on your trousers now for you thank you you'd like to try those on there okay excellent there's your look there that's great perfect so how do they feel for you can you move them around perfectly fine good that's good here there doesn't need to be much said about trousers we need to make sure that they're the right length there for you so i'm just going to measure both legs there okay one second So you'll find that this is going to have a real nice form to it when you uh, use it out if you need to of course on your archaeological adventures um, but this we of course have the clip on there and it's going to hang on your belt so if you don't mind i'll hang this on your belt there now thank you uh, left side or right simply just unclip there and it will come off okay and this will of course go around your belt here so this is all handmade leather here for you you'll notice this will weather down exceptionally quick uh, but you'll find it incredibly functional there as well so this will fall on your right side and the belt will go through here too
so it's very hard worry uh, but it will be exceptionally functional yeah, very functional for you so with a uh, brass clips there here is your belt dr jones this is very thick leather and this is going to be holding probably the most important thing you will need uh, for when you're in unknown places so to speak so this is not going to go anywhere you can see the thickness of the leather of this belt this is the finest leather we have okay reserved for um, someone such as yourself dr jones and i make sure that i always put things aside for you uh, if i know that they might be useful for you so we have here just a little bit of detail here on the belt for you okay on the buckles and then it's a uh, brass uh, buckle there as well all of the items here have been designed with your attire in mind stock streams so this i assume will just go around you okay okay just sort of mid waist lower waist okay and we will feed through your holster there as well and can I do that belt up there for you? Okay. and I suggest that maybe about this sort of length so I've seen you when your tie wasn't looking uh, the best shall we say I think that's probably where you had it previously and look at that good as new excellent okay so you're able to put whatever you need to put in that holster of course so dr jones a very important piece and uh, something which would probably be quite useful uh, your satchel here uh, which of course is a gas mask pack very simple uh, leather has been uh, upgraded there for you as well the same as your belt there it's very hard wear because of all of the important things that you might be putting in your satchel you want to make sure nothing is going to get lost so this is very uh, traditional here for you and i know this is a prized possession of yours so we've just taken the liberty to smarten that up there for you that's exactly how it was, but we've just changed the belt on there for you to make sure that it's going to functional for you. So let me just put that over you. Is that okay, Dr. Jones? Neck over the top there. Perfect. And that is looking exceptionally good to me. Okay. So one of the things here was your shoes. And we took the liberty to take the ones that you gave us and give them, gave them a complete rehaul. This is something which I too have done personally. All of the clothes here that you've given me is uh, something which I do myself and no one else gets involved, including with materials as well. something very special here for you. As ordered, your boots there, good as new, Dr. Jones, and might I say, the condition they were given me were say the least but then your previous adventure over in Cairo one would expect uh, not to be in the finest of conditions there okay so I've of course replaced the leather on there uh, this is very hard uh, wearing leather but also very durable as well and if you're on your feet uh, running around then you're not going to have any problems in that department these are going to last you we have glass buckles on there for tighter adjustments should you wish and then of course your leather laces here as well now i've also taken liberty just to give this a little bit of leather treatment there to make sure it's going to last a bit longer especially on the laces as i'm sure they'll be used quite often there as well and then these on the inside if i could just get paper yeah you've got a real nice 
was a hardware and material on the inside of the boot there as well. So this is custom stitching on the top of the boot here, all around the sole of the boot. Okay, and there's a rubber texture on there, which is going to give you extra grip when you need to. But I know that's probably going to um, wear out very quickly. Do. And then we have just a little bit of detail on the hill there as well. So these were all according to the previous specifications of your boots, Dr. Jones, and I'm pretty sure that these are going to perform even better than uh, your previous ones. So if you would allow me just to get them on your feet there and let me know how they feel. Uh, thank you so much for complimenting me. That's uh, really great that they look as, as good as new. <laughs> Indeed, I do wonder how long they will last. Probably not that long, Dr. Jones. Okay, let me put that here. Right, and also I've just added a spare uh, leather shoelace there too. So, considering the condition, everything that arrived to me, I think I've done quite an amazing job at repairing a lot of the items that you gave me. Nothing, of course, is my design. This is all hand-picked by you and previous items that we've just given a little bit of a spruce up, a little bit of an upgrade there as well. All of that looks perfect. But of course, Dr. Jones, your most important item, which we brought back, had a little look at. It was a little bit scuffed up, uh, but I'm pretty sure we've got it back in work in order there for you. Your leather jacket. as well, Dr. Jones, one of your hidden talents, and that's why I've taken liberty to make sure there's been extra space and maneuverability in the underarms there as well. So you might find just a slight little stretch in there, a little bit of extra space, but I thought that would probably be necessary for someone in your position, so to speak. I'm glad that you're 
you indeed know what I'm talking about. Okay. Well, you are one of a kind archaeologist, uh, Indiana Jones, and your reputation certainly does precede you uh, when it comes to me tailoring your clothes. You can tell a lot about, about a person by their clothes and what they've uh, been doing as well, with uh, leather jackets filled with dust and holes and uh, occasionally a bit of blood and scuff marks and everything, then one does seem to wonder that you're probably doing something than just simply digging in the ground for artifacts. Okay, so on the collar there as well, we have taken the liberty, or I have, to make sure that that is all nice and smooth and looked after leather there for you as well, so that's going to feel really nice around your neck there. And there's so everything's going to be very comfortable for you, Dr. Jones. Can I apply the jacket on you there? Excellent, thank you. Excellent. Well, I would say that is a pretty a completed uh, look that we have there. And of course, we have your most important thing. I took the liberty to take special care on this fedora for you, Dr. Jones. Well, our previous customers uh, don't have something um, as high quality as yours, and I noticed uh, the material on there. I made sure that it was all preserved and, and uh, put back exactly how you wanted it as well. Of course, I'm talking about your fedora hat here as well. Okay, so there's different types of fedora hats, beaver felt, a hair felt, um, skin, uh, fur, sorry. And uh, this particular one, you will notice that you're able to shape it uh, as your desired shape. So I know it wasn't so much uh, creased in there, but this time you are able to do that should you wish. Uh, you wanted the size here, circumference was a 60 or 60.5, so I'll take the liberty to make sure that is exactly that size there for you and the stitching is going to allow just for a little bit of extra movement on there as well. I put a slight band, leather band in there also to make sure that it's got extra grip on your head so you know it's not going to go anywhere. This is water resistant but try not to get it wet, Dr. Jones, because you'll just find that it will ruin your hat again. So if you can refrain from doing that as much as possible, uh, that would be appreciated. You'll ruin the shape, of course, but then once it's dry, it's very easy to shape back there as well. That's the beauty of these hats. Okay, so one might consider I'm a man of many talents when it comes to making these things, but I think we've, we've managed to make the appropriate Thanks for you there, Dr. James, and I think that's going to really look uh, good on you, and as good as new again. Of course, the first time I met you was when I was out on business and uh, seeing some clients. What country was that again? Yes, it was uh, quite secluded there, wasn't it? And uh, bumped into each other there as I was fitting someone, and luckily we managed to get talking, didn't we? And uh, I insisted that I could help you with your attire uh, on your downtime in between adventures sir and we haven't turned back since so that's perfect so let me get your hat into shape there okay I think that's looking good and uh, I think I can quite comfortably say uh, you lost today kid I'm not as really gonna like it let me just put that on there for you. Oh, wow. Just the, the whole attire, the archaeological look is 
is perfection. It really is. And we've completely uh, made it all as good as new ready for your next adventure. So please do try in the to try and keep it as clean looking as possible so we don't run into more problems. I mean every archaeological adventure you go on you seem to run into all of these problems and bad guys and people after you or fighting this and that and running away from God knows what and ruining all your clothing which of course is not desired though it's of course can be fixed um, but uh, when it comes to payment I don't suppose that you managed to acquire that particular artifact that I had interest in to have at my store you got it perfect thank you so much Dr. Jones that's great and I will gratefully accept your your generous contribution shall we say and uh, your well, we don't like to call it payment, it's just a, a favour for a favour, shall we say, and let's leave it at that. I do have a keen interest in certain artefacts, shall we say, so thank you so much for acquiring that for me, yeah, feel free to get it uh, whenever you want, and uh, have that drink with you now. But just make sure that all the attire is looking good for you, perhaps you'd like to look at it in the mirror there or something, and just to make sure everything's functioning there for you. Perfect. Well, it's uh, been an absolute pleasure. Again, Dr. Jones, just do be careful on your next adventures, okay? If you find yourself over across the pond, do come in and visit me as well. We can get you uh, even more things, uh, should you need them. But for your current look and making sure that everything's repaired and looking good, I think we've done a stupendous job. Excellent. Well, thank you. So great to see you again. Take care of yourself. Let's have that drink. Cheerio.